played a show in New York City on 42nd Street. It's called Stoned on 42nd Street. Like 42nd Street, New York City. So I did this show called Ziegfeld's Midnight Frolic, right? I'm sorry, what? What so key are you in? Oh, what key are you in? I'm, hang on, let me figure it out. <laughs> I never know. Anyway. So the story about that song is fun because it involves burlesque girls and weed. So uh, I'm doing a show and uh, I was playing the piano. And every night after the show, after rehearsal, I'd go out to 41st Street to the stage door and smoke a joint. But somehow, all the smoke went into the theater. Right? So the first night I went out there, 20 showgirls come walking out. Right? Still dressed in their, you know, not much. And they're all like, who's our new friends? But every single night after the show, me and a bunch of showgirls and showboys got high on it. It's on 41st Street, which isn't really like 42nd Street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It sounds cool. That's where it's at. Yeah. 42nd, 42nd it's at. Street. Yeah. You did that on purpose. I like showgirls and burlesque. Oh, Dolly Debutante. She was the first one. I used to work at a burlesque club. Yeah. I did. I don't know any of their real names. That's the funny thing. We've been friends for years. It's better that way. Oh no, it's good. Yeah. I don't want to know their names. Uh, Dolly and Pearls Daily. <laughs> uh, Delicia, what was it? Delicia Lachey. Felicia? No, 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 no. Delicia, Delicia. Delicia Lachey, which means delicious pussy in French. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Delicious pussy. Yeah. She's amazing. amazing. Hopefully her pussy isn't getting grabbed right now. Uh, uh, I couldn't resist, I'm sorry. No, you're right. Low hanging fruit. You <laughs> <laughs> talking about balls? <laughs> we digress. It's approaching midnight. That's what happens. Alright, so we're going to do another song here and call it a night. Thank you guys so much for sharing this day. Seriously, no. This is a fucking sweet experience tonight. I woke up this morning and I cried and I cried and I cried and I thought, you know what, something good has to happen today. Something good has to happen, and it did. Some friends came together and played some music, hung out, drank some beers, and communed with each other, and to me that's the best fucking weapon ever against bullshit, so. And my guitar is going to have 